we like to say that House of Europe is about connecting people and opportunities. So, so what does that mean? We want to connect professionals in Ukraine with their colleagues in the European Union. My name is Katerina Nosko. I am the founder of East Publishing. Ми вже встигли е, взяти участь у двох open call-ах – це грант на переклади, а також грант мобільності. Hello, my name is uh, Georg Stecker. We are a partner in Austria of this production. The running or the leading partner for this work is uh, the ensemble, the company Nova Opera. And I have to be honest, myself, I'm learning. That's what this production is bringing to me or the, the connection with the ensemble Nova Opera in the last two years. I'm learning about how much uh, artistical excellency is on the way. My name is Gavrilyuk Maria. I am the director of the project Hunya Project. Ми розуміємо, що у нас немає бізнес-освіти і що нам потрібна якісна оцінка професіоналів. Ну і, власне, за цим ми пішли в Creative Business Academy. Мене звати Богдан Волинський. Ми знаходимося в ДАС. Це дитяча архітектурна школа. Сама академія дає можливість побачити себе в глобальному контексті. Ти весь час спілкуєшся з різними людьми, з різних куточків світу, у яких є досвід. І так значно легше уявляти свій шлях. The House of Europe is mostly an EU-funded project. There is a network of cultural organizations from the EU that are active in Ukraine. It's called OINIC. Out of this OINIC network, four have formed a consortium that actually takes this grant from the European Union and implements it on their behalf. This consortium is made up of the Goethe Institute, which is the lead implementer, the British Council, the Institut Francais and the Czech Centre. And those four organisations manage the implementation of House of Europe, but they also closely work together with the other EU national cultural institutes in Ukraine. The House of Europe is working with six sectors, culture and creative industries. That's the biggest part of the program. Second is education, media and journalism, social entrepreneurship, health. And we are working with youth and people that are working with youth. There are more than 20 program lines. Проект «Первая выставка Гаража 127» существует при поддержке Дома Европы, House of Europe и программы Creative Youth. Это наш первый грант, который мы получаем вместе с гаражом. Кроме того, это первый международный проект для гаража. I'm Winnie Herbstein. I'm an artist. I came on as a mentor. I spoke about my reading of the work from my context and then encouraged the artists to speak about what their work meant coming from their context. A lot of the artists are making work that is political and really interesting work and it was really exciting to see that. But as time went on and I began speaking with the people and, and carrying on my conversations with Anton and Anastasia, I began to understand more where these artists were coming from and that was, that was really important for me. We also have um, several dedicated program lines that target the region specifically. So one uh, we call the pop-up hubs and uh, here the idea really is that this house of Europe um, pops up in a different place, in an already existing house of a cultural organization or a creative hub somewhere in a regional center of Ukraine. And then there is a second program line um, for those regions where there even is no such infrastructure. And uh, here we are building our own uh, infrastructure. We are building a mobile, a transportable house, a mobile, a mobile pavilion, by which we will uh, be traveling through the periphery of the country and show up in places for a couple of weeks uh, providing a space for artists, for creative minds, for activists, for agents of change. The House of Europe holds a special place within the European Union's support to Ukraine. Its budget exceeds 12 million euro for four years of activities. Its target groups are uniquely dynamic and among the most active ones. Artists, creative entrepreneurs, media and healthcare professionals, teachers, young people. Together with their colleagues and fellows all over the EU, in the House of Europe, they all exchange views, share their projects, debate and help build a future that is more inclusive, more resilient and more creative. It's about 
going to the people, giving people a place where they can actually meet each other, where they can encounter and which they can inhabit with their ideas and with their fantasy.